Well, thanks a lot for clicking on WXYZ.com on this wintry Monday. I'm 7 First Alert Meteorologist Chris Edwards with more accumulating snow in the forecast for the balance of today and more for the afternoon hours on Tuesday as the series of low pressure areas coming at us from the west continues to move through. They move through rather quickly, though. Matter of fact, the winter weather advisory only in effect until 2 o'clock this afternoon south of 8 Mile Road. We're talking about Wayne, Washtenaw, off to the west in Jackson County, and farther to the south in Monroe and Lenaway counties and Hillsdale counties as well. That until 2 o'clock this afternoon because the snow will move south not long after that. It'll be still be snowing after that, but the heaviest of the snow is in the early part of the afternoon. That winter weather advisory comes because 2 to 3 inches of snow will fall in that area. There'll be a little less north of 8 Mile Road. The farther north you go, the lighter accumulations. The snow should end by sunset, and then there's more in the afternoon and evening hours on Tuesday. Here are our exclusive first alert storm threats for today. Higher the number, the bigger the impact. And we have a moderate impact with snow and on the roadways. There is some melting on the treated roadways during the daylight hours as the energy from the sun gets through the clouds. So the roads are not as bad as they could be, but the secondary roads are certainly going to be slick. The cold with temps in the teens. A moderate issue on a two. As far as our future cast goes, here's that fast moving low pressure area drifting to the south of us rather quickly, and by the evening rush hour, the snow is gone. We're then quiet overnight, kind of cold, especially where the clouds break apart, and the morning rush hour on Tuesday will be dry. The next fast moving low will still be in Wisconsin at that hour, but for the evening rush hour on Tuesday, there it is again. Snow showers will once again be moving through the metro area and accumulating. We'll probably see one to two inches of snow by sunset, maybe just a little bit more after sunset before that one quickly moves out. And Wednesday, believe it or not, we'll actually see a day without snow. Hmm, haven't said that in a while. As far as this afternoon, snow ending late, two to three inch total, slightly less in the far northern suburbs with a light southwesterly wind. Mostly cloudy, dry, and cold overnight. Nothing more than a flurry early. And then an 80% chance of afternoon snow for our Tuesday, 1 to 2 inches by sunset. Once again, not that much in the way of wind, though. It does get a little breezy late in the day. Seven-day forecast features that dry day on Wednesday and up to 29 degrees. Now, later in the day Thursday, another area of snow showers doesn't look all that strong, but there could be some more accumulation, 33 then mid-30s Friday, and look at this weekend, 35 with some sunshine Saturday, and if anything falls on Sunday, it's probably cold rain, maybe a wet snowflake mixed in, but uh, high temperature Sunday, close to 40 degrees, actually above average, so we're going to come out of the snowy cold pattern at least a little bit as we head toward the weekend and beyond. Thanks for checking in with WXYZ.com. Have a great afternoon.